I'm going to make this light bow today. Here in Denmark this is a very common thing around Christmas. These are normally standing in the windows and lighting up. I am going to glue together some of these stir stick pieces that I had lying around so that I can make this little bow of them. I used my scroll saw to cut out this little bow. I thought I had recorded how I drew it onto this little piece of wood, but sadly I didn't. I am going to leave a link in the info box below for this print file. I sanded the piece a bit and then I am going to cut out two small feet for it. I'm using my easy cutter to cut out the feet from a piece of an icicle. Then I'm going to glue on the feet on the bow and when that is all dry I'm going to paint it red. Now I am going to work on the candles and I'm going to make seven of these. So first I am rolling out a tiny piece of white clay into a long thin snake that fits the picture that I'm working from. After baking I cut the cane into the length that the lights are going to be. To make the light bulb that is made like a flame, I am first taking a tiny tiny piece of orange that I am placing on top of each of these small candles. Then I take some translucent clay and I am making the flame uh, shape around this orange piece that we just made. Then my candles is ready and I am going to take a little of this greenery that I have had lying for a long time. I cut it into length so that I can glue it around the end of the candle. I'm using a super glue gel to glue this uh, greenery on. Just remember to watch your fingers when you're doing this. And then I forgot to push the record button before I glued on each of these candles. But I hope you can see how they are sitting in this picture anyway. I'm using a tiny bit of UV resin around the light bulbs. Thank you. 
and then I decided to glaze the red part on this. I should have done that before I glued on the candles, but I was not that smart. So that is it for the first Christmas video this year from me. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for watching and happy crafting.